All right, let's talk about some stuff that takes zero paintballs to help you be better on the field. My name's Greg, you're watching How to Play Paintball. So there are a couple different little tricks that you can use on the field that maybe you've you've not thought of before or someone has not taught you and that's what we're going to be going over today uh but first let's talk about the refs so for refing the one of the things that uh they try not to do this but something that you can look out for especially if there's a snake like this is a kind of a crazy snake over here that people can kind of get lost in if you want to have a better chance of being able to find where that person is or if they even got into the snake usually the refs will be standing off to the side of the field like this you know watching or whatever but as the player moves, you might see their head move a little bit. So look to see where is it that they're looking. At least if they have a tinted lens, it's gonna make it a little bit more difficult, but uh, at least look in the direction. So if they're looking this way, maybe there's someone in the middle, or maybe there's someone that is right here. The other thing that's kind of a giveaway is if they start to turn a little bit, they might turn to really be able to watch the player, or they might start doing this and they might start backing up. So those are things that you can look for that even if the player is playing the snake exactly the way that they're supposed to, the ref might be giving that away a little bit of their movement. The other thing with refs is if I was going to uh, be refing, you have to go in and check. So uh, if you know you're shooting over somewhere and you see the, the ref run in and go like this, you know, to go check the player, when they're checking the player, you might be able to make a move or even go run that person down. I know it's kind of messed up, but if they can't shoot you, <laughs> like, it makes it a little bit easier to shoot them. So it's one of those things that if they're getting checked, and you make a move and they shoot and they have a hit on them, they might get a penalty. Uh, or if you run them down and then they start shooting at you, well, that might get them a penalty as well. So it's one of those things that you're playing off the chaos. If you see the ref run in to go check a player, that could be a perfect time to go in and make a move uh, further out wider or make the move that you were trying to make because the person is doing this, waiting for the ref to check them so that, that way they can get back to playing or the ref is maybe in their way and they might not even see that move. So the other ref that you might see oh, is the laydown ref. Now the laydown ref is there to watch the people that are coming up the middle and also be able to watch the insides of the, uh, the players that are you know, maybe not as easy to see cross field. They may be able to see someone diving out, getting shot. So you have the refs on the sidelines, you have a couple laydown refs, but the laydown refs, the thing that is really good and bad at the same time is let's say that there was a player that was moving up to the middle of the field or going over this way. Well, the ref is gonna have to do this to look over or they might even do this and they might turn. That's an indicator that someone has moved or you might even see them kind of looking over in a certain direction. They're gonna try not to or they should try not to, uh, to give it away, but they still need to do their job. So look and see where is it that this ref is looking. Could I kind of estimate, hey, there's a player over there. Or, hey, caution this. Even if someone's being super sneaky and you see the ref start doing this, or you see their head move like that, or they slide over, that's gonna be something that's gonna tell you that, okay, well, maybe someone made a move. So that's gonna be the first in our series here on tips that are gonna be literally taking no paintballs whatsoever to make you a better on the field. So watch those refs, see what it is that they're doing, where is it that they're looking, how is it that you can use that information to better your position, or uh, I think someone might have moved and we didn't catch it. Look for those things. So be on the lookout for the next part in this series. Uh, please make sure to like, subscribe, and click the bell. Thank you everyone for all your support. And uh, as always, remember, watch, learn, win. Thanks.